good morning children this lesson is of class 7 for the subject of biology chapter number 5 excretion in humans of your textbook concise biology selina publications it is being submitted to you on 23rd november 2020 in the last lesson we have discussed the human excretory system and the various substances that has to be excreted from our body today we are going to discuss the structure of kidney and the role of kidneys in urine formation internally each kidney is composed of an outer darker region called cortex and an inner lighter region called medulla a white funnel shaped cavity is present at the concave side of both the kidneys called renal pelvis where the medulla drain the urine the ureters originate from here the function of the kidneys is to filter the blood and remove nitrogenous waste such as urea and uric acid it also removes excess water soluble salts like sodium and other dissolved waste in the form of urine from the body the structure and the functional unit of kidney is nephron n e p h r o n nephron an artery called the renal artery brings in the blood containing waste into the kidneys each kidney contains about a million microscopic filtering units called the nephrons nephrons are the sites where blood is filtered and the waste are removed reabsorption of water and required salts take place within the nephron each nephron starts as a cup like bowman's capsule which continues behind as a narrow tubule the tubule is convoluted having three parts number 1 proximal convoluted tubule number 2 loop of henle number 3 distal convoluted tubule and it opens into the collecting duct now let us see how urine is formed in kidneys step 1 filtration it occurs in the glomerulus where water and solutes are filtered out of the blood the filtrate then moves into the bowman's capsule it consists of large amount of water glucose sodium and potassium ions vitamins and 
harmful substances like urea and uric acid step 2 reabsorption as the filtrate moves towards the urinary tubule approximately 99% water all the glucose and most of the sodium and chloride ions are reabsorbed by the renal capillaries step 3 secretion the nephrons remove the waste substances such as excess water mineral salts and urea from the blood and convert it into urine step 4 excretion the urine that is formed in the kidneys is sent to the ureters for its further collection in the urinary bladder when the bladder is full the urine is expelled to the outside through the urethra the process of expulsion of the urine to the outside is called urination the normal human urine mainly consists of water urea uric acid and some amount of mineral salts with this topic i am ending today's lesson kindly go through the topic at least twice to understand it well also draw the diagram of kidney and structure of nephron in your notebooks thank you children